Welcome, ladies and gents, back to the 3O channel where we live and learn by listening. Thanks so much for tagging along for our second episode of our marathon weekend with the Brothers Gibb. Thanks so much for spending time with me. And folks, listen up. If you're new here to the channel, just visiting for the very first time, my name is Chad. Welcome, welcome. Kick your feet up, relax, enjoy some great music. We do this every other weekend. Bee Gees marathons, and then on the alternate weekends, oldies and classics. If that sounds like something that would spark your interest, consider subscribing to the channel to get locked in right here on 3L so you don't miss one single post. And folks, that being said, we're kind of splitting off in a new direction today. You guys stay tuned. Apologize for the quality. It's the only available one on YouTube. So let's jump in. <laughs> what the Welcome hell? Welcome to the Songwriters Workshop. Here, many songs of, of world renown are written. Just these few people here. What is that? Is that Robin? <laughs> He's got a whole like. Oh my God. <laughs> I can't really tell like because it's kind of fuzzy, but it looks like they're trying so hard to keep a straight face. I don't think I'm going to be able to just saying before this reaction even gets started. <laughs> oh my God. Around this, piano. this is one of them. Uh, we actually came up with this idea, and you remember this, I write the song. This is how it came up with. We were just playing around and something happened. Something just happened. <laughs> yeah. Something magic. Hey, you know, but they, they, you know, they don't want to hear all our stuff. Go, go ahead. Go just do it. Yeah. I write the songs. I sing the whole world through. I sing the things and everything. I write the songs. I have the whole world through. I write the songs and for you. I, I'm sorry, are they, are they mocking Barry Manilow right now? <laughs> I'm, I, I'm sorry, Let, let's jump back yeah, in. Yeah, okay. you know, I mean, that speaks for itself, doesn't it? They just Number sort of one. Yeah, it speaks for itself. Number one, all over the yeah. place. Yeah. All over the town. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> So the, the Songwriters Workshop then is based on uh, people who write songs. People who write songs, people who have got ideas. Some, yeah. yeah. That are talented like, you yeah. know, want to write. How do you construct a song then, Rob? Yeah. yeah. Mo, how does it start? Well, you know. For the people listening in today. Melody. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, sorry, yeah. You've got the lyrics. We try our best at this workshop to give you an insight on how we come up with a hit, like. <laughs> Robin. This is a cut up. Oh my gosh. Number one, I can't get over Robin. I, I mean, they're all funny, but like. Uh... <laughs> It looks like he's at a Catholic mass, but that wig and sunglasses, man, it's just, I think the priest would come by and throw him out of the service. And then Mo at the piano, he kind of looks like, uh, what's his name from uh, ELO? Uh, Jeff Lynn right now. <laughs> oh my gosh. Let's keep going. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Like, well, we got to write, we got, we've written 15 songs to the Beatles. Yeah. I had no idea. I had no idea. <laughs> what was the idea you had? Okay, it was just an idea, you know. Yeah. What was the idea? It was, um, I got to, oh, I like it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
Yeah. You know what? I've got, got somebody in mind for this. Hit me. Yeah, I, I, when you sing that, I thought the Bay City Rollers immediately. Oh, yeah. I think it would be a fantastic yeah. for them. They will be good. The they will be good. So they have to wear the same clothes. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's, well, that's part of the condition, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. It yeah, makes me like wonder what things yeah, that they're on uh, right now. Uh, no, when you're I mean, looking at me, well, you recognise them walking down the street. No, no, they have to wear the same clothes. Yeah, they want to play. Oh my god. What was I just watching? <laughs> Those guys are absolute clowns. It was like a three ring circus. <laughs> and David English pulling his shirt up. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. They either had one too many or they were smoking something, but they were having a blast. So fun watching these guys in their element. And you know, folks, it just goes to show what I was saying earlier. If it wasn't going to work as far as music for them, comedians. That would have been next in line. Completely hilarious. And you know, watching this clip, it it, it takes me back. I, I believe I saw something like this or reacted to, um, was it called Technicolor, uh, Technicolor Nights or something like that. You guys fill me in in the comments. I, I think I'm close. I think it's Technicolor Nights, uh, the, the same, um, footage. I think it might have been the same night that this was recorded and it had, you know, David English as well. So I think it was probably the same during the same filming. But anyway, you guys let me know the details. That was funny. Nice change of pace. I'm thinking about doing an interview uh, this marathon too as well. So you guys stay tuned for that. Thanks again for this request. And while I'm on the subject of shout outs, uh, I want to apologize. The last video I did, uh, the template for the shout outs, I didn't even edit it. So the people that were listed probably did not request it. I might have got lucky in there somewhere, but forgive me for that. Overlooked the shout-outs last time around. Thanks again, folks. Until next time, take care.